Hello and welcome back to We Happy Few. And th there's going to be a slight change. Um, I've not played any of the games since I heard that I was, was played, a hell of a party. Um, it was a party, wasn't it? I'm not Shit. sure if, how noticeable it is. It is very noticeable to me, but um, I I have a new computer with a graphics card that isn't from a decade ago, so. We are finally back in the game, and uh, yeah, I'm not sure where we last left off. Um, baby appears to be okay. Yeah. I don't have a canteen. Do I have any water? Will do. The baby appears to be fine. Let's go. Ooh, that's a thing. Don't have any sunshine. We'll have to take joy if necessary. Okay, and time, 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 time. Where's the time? Ooh, 6.33. We'll sleep first, we'll sleep. Sleepy, sleepy, sleep. Thing. Do can I run around yet? Tippy toes. There are people ignore bad habits, so I can do this. Yes. My stamina is shit, but I can run. I don't know. I I I know it's extremely visible for me. What? Hold on. Was that like that previously? Is the entire building on holiday? How am I supposed to get fish and chips when the building's on holiday? Oh my god. Does this count as breaking and entering? Was this, was this like this previously? Okay, I suppose the fish and chips have to go on holiday eventually at some point, right? Oh, inventory. Uh, nope, that was where I needed to be. That'll do. I like I think one of the main things that I saw when I first loaded the game um when I got the PC was the fact that you can actually see the grass <laughs> That shouldn't be that shouldn't have been like the giveaway but just being able to see the grass in the game <laughs> was phenomenal Right. Mm. The phone. This is for the benefit of Mr. Kite. The rabbit got into the garden. The rabbit got into the garden. Sounds like some sort of secret message. No, really, Sally? Really? I thought they were just talking about a rabbit getting into the garden. Just 
Here we go. Well, young Miss Boyle. You know the curfew? You don't want some Brits to shoot you dead, do you? Sorry, sir. Let's get you home. You had another fight with your mum, didn't you? Bit personal. Why don't I put in a good word? Miss, uh, Mrs. Boyle, I've got a young lady out here who, um... I'm sorry. They don't seem to be at home. What? Let me go in. They're not at home. Let me take you to the oh station. Oh, God. For a cup of tea. What happened? Let me in. Best you don't go in, miss. A cup of tea's best. What did she do? What did she do? What, what did she do? Oh no, don't. Let me in. Dad. Mum and the girls. And Mum said, you don't have to worry about the train. No one's going on the train. Shut up, Sally. You're a big girl. Stop crying. Mate. Sorry, do I have a torch? No. Okay. Genuinely thought I was gonna die then. Um, right, okay. So there's shit. Okay. Okay. It gets so dark.
work? Did he? Wait. Maybe not. Really? <laughs> you saw nothing! Right. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh no. Um I don't have anything to make another distraction, so uh Me for the posh girls in year seven. Are you telling me that I don't have a single lockpick? Oh, fuck me. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> Fix my lab. I think that's everything from up here. Nothing at all. Right. Back to the lab. Uh, that way. start searching everything because I've clearly not been hoarding enough. I should not have been caught without a lockpick, honestly. I wish they'd left it broken. Hit. Um, water filler. Do I need metal tube?
morning. Have you got my bird feeder? Ah, uh, no, not quite. Check back in a little while. Crest, okay. Got anything yummy in you? Um. Ciao, darling. There we go. That'll do. Shouldn't have to keep turning that fucking thing off. I'm coming, child of mine. I'm coming. Uh, what am I doing? That's why I don't want kids. <laughs> this right here. This is why. Noise. Right. We don't have any tap water. Goodness, aren't you hungry? I already had milk made up, didn't I? Had a moment, sorry. Okay, let's just get on with the repair. Now I just need to replace all my chemicals. <laughs> Stuart. I've got to talk to Stuart. Oh, not again. Maybe he's got the chemicals I need squirreled away somewhere. I've just come from there. is upstairs tinkering when will he be it's been weeks now it's a device you left behind apparently it's quite clever and complex i just came to buy some chemicals over my cold dead body fiona it's not just borrowing my man while you were here i could have got over that it's the ambitions you put into him fiona i'm sorry he wants to be more than a village chemist how's that i says Will you go to London to study to be a doctor? Will you take over Hayworth Labs? She still wouldn't take you back, I says. But you've sold him the stars. And now he can't barely see where he's going. Maybe he liked me because I thought he could be more. You ever think of that? Get out of here. Get out, you witch. And don't Whoa. let the door hit you in the arse on the way out. <sighs> How British. Okay. Well, she's mellowed. Fiona said Stuart's been working on my old pituitary extractor. Maybe, maybe I can get it back from him later, when she's not in the shop. Wait, Harry Cavendish, he still works for the labs, isn't he? And he owes me a favor. Uh, pills, 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 pills. I'll drop by his house. Harry? It's Sally. 
Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. <laughs> Sally Boyle. Whoa. I haven't seen you in a dog's age. What? Uh, what oh. happened to your eyes? Oh, this little thing. A doctor used miscalculated the brominating reaction and it blew up in my face. Then he Literally. convinced Dr. Furlock it was my fault. So what? I got the sack. That weasel. Oh, you don't have to pretend you're interested in the tedious old lab. How's the glamorous life of an experimental chemist? It's a bit blocked at the moment. Can't get mercury amalgam. Did you know they vent gallons of it onto rat home? Oh, well, you wouldn't. You've moved on to greener pastures. I'm sorry. I thought Anton knew what he was doing. Oh, I don't blame you for leaving us all behind. When love fades, you have to move on. Well, I'm sure you'll figure out where to find some amalgam. Maybe I will. But someone's got to prove it was Dr. Hughes's fault you lost your eyes. You know, you're right. He could hurt someone else. Is there... Any evidence that it was his fault? You know, now that you mention it, his lab notes. He keeps them in his doctor bag. I bet they're all the evidence I need. Oh, you know what? I bet they'd also tell me how to extract the amalgam you need out of the stuff the lab is piping onto rat home. I'll get you his lab notes. Here's where he lives. Come back, and I'll tell you where to find the pump outlet. Don't go anywhere. Wouldn't dream of it. <laughs> I just slammed the door in my face. How are you okay in there, dude? You good? Oh, where am I going? Okay. Well, you can't say Dr. Hughes doesn't have a keen sense of style. Whoa. I'd better be particularly careful in there. Really bring out the if he knows I'm there, it'll get nasty fast. Oh no. Oh no. Upstairs again, Jesus Christ. Come on, take the bait. What's that? What's going on? What's that? This must be the bag Harry wanted.
Who's there? What's that? What's that? Who's there? What's going on? Get out. Good lord, I've got a down here. Leg it. Leg it. Leg it. Leg it. Oh my god, why does it sound like he's got a chainsaw? Did you? Quite a sturdy bag. Oh, so I'm I'm here. Here. Nope! You're coming with me. Oh, you She'd need to be able to breathe. Some source of oxygen. And soundproofing in case she starts crying. I bet Lionel could make something like that. Oh no. So many. You remember the victory? Harry? It's Sally. Uh, Sally Boyle. Just a moment. Just a moment, damn it. I can't get to the door as fast as I used to. <laughs> Did you get Dr. Hughes's bag? I've got it. Aren't you Brillo? Well, here's the formula you need. You can get to Rat Home via the maintenance tunnels. There's a code at the door. It's 1649. I really am sorry about the accident. I thought Anton had a handle on things. Well, now we know. Cheerio. That was nasty. I'll need a few things before I go. I can get there from any hatch, now that I've got the code. Hatch. Whoa. Oi! Nope. What are you doing there? <laughs> the one that does it. Now don't wet while I'm changing you. Alright, I think I might actually call this episode here. Just so that we can do the next thing on the next part, so that's it for today. I'll see you in the next episode. Cheerio.